A student produced this for UND's TV show, Studio One. Most everyone has different ways to escape the worries we face in our daily lives. One man goes back to the simple times to restore peace of mind. Behind this rigid chain fence lies a pile of scrap metal pumps and old blades. To most, these piles mean nothing, but for Dan Herrig, it means much more. It all started with my dad and that when I was about eight years old. Dan and his pup Penny spend countless hours among these piles. When they are picked apart and put together just perfectly, it is no longer junk you see, but a work of art, something his father would be proud of. He kind of got into collecting windmills at first. He wanted one or two, and then it became three or four, five, ten, twenty, fifty. Dan and his family collect and restore old farm windmills. These are the forgotten farm fixtures that used to dot rural America. He brings these classic to life, allowing their past beauty to peek through to the present. Generally when we're painting one and uh, restoring for new, it, it's painted with new. We're not very good at uh, distressing. These forgotten fixtures originally were sources of running water and machinery. Dan understands they may no longer be necessary, but they shouldn't be forgotten. They're getting very hard to find. We're going to try to to restore it as correctly as we can to the way it was originally made. This one I bought on eBay. He displays these antique pieces of art in memory of his father, allowing his dreams to sail in serenity. With photographer Marty Mueller, I'm Ella Dorner, reporting for Studio One. After two years of hard work, Dan will be finished with his most recent masterpiece. It will be shown in the Texas Windmill Museum for hundreds of fans.